Orchids. That's what we're talking about today. We're talking about orchids. Pretty particular little beauties that don't like to be necessarily potted up in dirt like other plants. Yes. Many of them live in forest canopies. Uh, up high up there, relying upon what rain and wind and whatever comes from the sky to hit them. Some live further down, but all of them are decidedly different sorts of plants. Some of them are extremely tiny, such as this little number here. Now this book doesn't have actual photographs, of course. They have plates. Along with updated information on everything there is to know about orchids. Including the fact that you can't go out and snabble them up from the wild. No, you can't. You must leave the little beauties alone because they have become endangered. There are plenty of reputable suppliers so you can get your own if you're into orchids. I must warn you though, while some are tiny and like low light, dim levels of light, Others grow bloody huge. The biggest one they found thus far weighs three tons. One plant, three tons. So, those monsters you can... Oh my. Uh, they are weird. Some of them temporarily trap pollinators. Others have unknown pollinators. Some are very weird and nasty looking beasties. But there's something for everyone in every habitat. So if you would like one of these beauties, the book itself, Sandra Knapp, written this wonderful book just one of many interests that most people have is the odd orchid now for the United States the orchids we have are in the lady slipper category and those you can plant in the ground and in the in the woods and just basically leave them alone. Just make sure you get the right one for your area. Because later slippers come in a wide variety. Something to suit any area. Still, the book is readily available. Very interesting. Although it does get a little technical at times. I'm sure you can handle it. I hope you enjoyed this. I plan on getting some lady slippers myself, but because I don't have room for those huge things. Jeez. Plant weighs three tons. Just gorgeous blooms, of course. But still, three tons. Hmm. In any case, I hope you enjoyed this. Thank you for watching, and please do come again.